Shall I take off? Yeah. Hello everyone, hope you all are having a fantastic time. The fundamental concept of virtual reality is that you could be physically present somewhere and at the same time you could be virtually present somewhere else. A drone with a live video feed does exactly this, allowing you to see through its camera in real time. And a VR headset makes the experience much more immersive. And with the head tracking feature enabled, the camera tilts and the drone pans in response to the movement of your head. So you could literally control the drone just with your head, without even touching the controller. So virtually, I could be up in the air flying like a bird, although physically, I could be in my couch sipping my favorite drink. So what all do we need to get this up? Number one, a DJI drone like the Phantom, Inspire or Mavic. Number two, a software that splits your video feed into two sections, Leechy is the app that I'm using and a VR headset that encapsulates your phone. And now you have a pretty efficient VR machine that not only gives you an immersive experience but also head tracks for you. An alternate option is to use the DJI goggles which are expensive but easier to use and better on quality. But if you're just curious to see how this concept works, the setup I suggested is a steal for what it can offer. Now, one thing to remember is that the camera on these drones have a pretty narrow field of view when compared to the human eye. So with the VR goggles on, you see much lesser of an area than what you would see with your eyes. So you would be reluctant to take sudden turns due to the constant fear of colliding with something that is not in your visual perspective. And that's why I've chosen a location today that does not have too many obstacles around, so I'm not bothered about crashing into something. To make things interesting, I planned a simple hide and seek game, but with a twist. So my friends are going to take the drone away from me and hide it in a place that I don't know about. And the objective of the game is to find myself through the drone and fly it back to me within a given time. That's like finding my real self, but virtually. Considering the fact that the drone has a travel radius of around 7 kilometers, they are free to choose any spot within this radius. The drone is going to be turned off while they're transporting it and once they've placed it, they shall turn it on, which is also going to notify me that I'm ready to start. All the telemetry information like the distance, height and direction is going to be disabled in the video feed, so I do not get any kind of assistance while finding myself. This is going to be fun and here we go. I'm actually pretty confident about cracking this thing easily as I have the advantage of being familiar with this locality. And the first thing I'm going to do is to fly at an altitude high enough to get a good view of my surroundings and identify the direction I need to head towards. I don't see myself yet. I'll keep turning around. And there I am. so excited to see myself so here I am flying around myself and I would like to call this an out-of-body experience you really need to experience it to feel it we had an amazing time and we got some wonderful shots if you have any real-world scenarios that can utilize this technology please share it in the comment section below and before we wind up in my next video we're going to use this beautiful rifle and do some target practices using a drone so the next video is going to be very interesting so please subscribe, stay tuned and thank you so much for watching.